Welcome to another episode of Talking with Docs. I'm Dr. Brad Weenan. And I'm Dr. Paul Zalzal. And our guest, I'm Dr. Arjun Krishna. On today's episode, we're going to talk about another type of anesthetic that we use. To, um, this is something called an adductor canal block. Dr. Krishna, could you explain what that is? Sure. So an adductor canal block is essentially where we take local anesthetic or a freezing medication and we place it in the front aspect of the thigh to help numb the knee. So what this does is it helps reduce pain that might be experienced after surgery, after the spinal anesthetic is worn off, yeah. to reduce pain after, for, for knee replacement surgery generally. Um, so essentially we use an ultrasound machine. Yep. We look at the anatomy in the leg, uh, with the muscle, the blood vessels, and the nerves. And essentially we place the local anesthetic in the appropriate location around the blood vessel because in this case the nerve is sometimes difficult to see. Okay. So we know that it's around the blood vessel and by placing the local anesthetic around it, we're able to get the effect that we desire. So you're just kind of bathing that nerve and freezing exactly. and then it That's lasts right. for a while. Okay. Yeah. Would you mind if we watched you do it? Absolutely. Okay, let's go check out an inductor canal block. So here we're going to do the adductor canal block, which is um, applying some freezing medicine to the thigh area of the leg. And this essentially causes numbness to the front part of the knee, which is another form of pain relief for uh, after the total knee replacement. Uh, and essentially, I'm, in my left hand, you can see this uh, probe here. That's an ultrasound machine. It helps me uh, recognize the anatomy. And then in the other hand, we have the needle here. Um, we've already performed a spinal anesthetic, so the skin is already numb, so this should not hurt at all. Sometimes people will put some freezing in the skin to also reduce that uh, pain uh, from the injection. Okay. So, here you go. so you're going to feel some pressure in your leg here. So we have a good image there, and I'm just using the image to find my needle. Do you mind just aspirating there? It's clean. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. It's yep. going well. Perfect. Keep going there. Fine. Yep. So we can see the medication spreading in the proper location in the okay. leg there. Five. Yeah, you can just give it all there. Okay. All of it there is good. Okay. It's flowing nicely. Yeah. So that ultrasound device has really made this a lot easier a procedure. That's, That's correct, yeah. So now we have a much better visualization of various anatomical structures such as the muscles, the arteries and veins. Yeah, all of it can go there. Yeah. So where are you trying to get and this freezing? The nerve. So in this nerve block what we do is we look for the artery that uh, it may not be that easy to see now because I've given the local anesthetic medication but we look for the artery in the leg there, the femoral artery and essentially we're uh, putting the local anesthetic around that artery because we know that which is called the con adductor canal, that location. Uh, I'll give you the mm -hmm. yeah, I'll take that. And basically we know, that, and I'm, I'm just scanning to make sure that this, the medication is spread appropriately. We know that when the medication spreads are in the adductor canal, the nerve travels in that area and we can, with uh, enough uh, medication, we'll get some uh, anesthetic around the nerve to help reduce the pain. Well that looked fairly straightforward. Thank you very much Dr. Krishna. No problem. Mm -hmm. Dr. Krishna, that was very cool. Thank you mm -hmm. for showing us the adductor canal block. We wanted to get Mark Wahlberg, but it turns out he knows jack about <laughs> anesthesia, so <laughs> we got you instead again. Not a bad second. <laughs> so if you guys like this video, please like it and subscribe to our channel. And remember, you are in charge of your own health. See you next time.